Hello children. In the previous video, we learned about what is a tenth. In this video, we will learn more about it through some interesting examples. It is very hot this time in Champapur. All the villagers are distressed due to the heat. Raju and Bablu are walking in the market. Raju, it is so hot nowadays. I have to take a bath twice a day. Bablu said to Raju, wiping his sweat. Yes, Bablu, I am also feeling very hot. This morning, I heard on the radio that today the temperature in Champapur is 35.4 degrees Celsius. What is degree Celsius, Raju? Degree Celsius is the unit for measuring temperature. Raju explained to Bablu. Okay, I understood degree Celsius. 35.4 degrees Celsius. Raju, 35 is fine. But what is this 0.4? Bablu asked Raju. One tenth indicates that a degree is being divided into 10 equal parts. And because the number after the decimal point is 4, we can say that here we are taking 4 out of the 10 parts of a degree. In this way, we can also write 0.4 as 4 tenth in the form of a fraction. Raju explained to Bablu. Well, if tomorrow's temperature is 36.2 degrees Celsius, then we can say that 0.2 degrees Celsius is 2 tenth of a degree Celsius or 2 by 10 of a degree Celsius. Bablu said excitedly. Alright Bablu, let us go for a walk on the seashore. We will get some relief from this terrible heat. Wow, Raju! Let's buy new slippers for you and me so that we can have a lot of fun on the beach. In the shoe shop, Gagu first measured Raju's foot. Raju, your foot is a little over 15 centimeters. Bablu told Raju. Yes, Bablu. My foot measures 15 centimeters and 4 millimeters. Now, what is this millimeter? Bablu asked Raju. Look, there are 10 equal parts of a centimeter on a scale. So, how much part of a centimeter is each of these parts? Raju asked Bablu. One tenth. Bablu quickly responded. Exactly. One tenth of a centimeter is called a millimeter. And the measure of your foot is 4 tenth or 4 millimeters longer than 15 centimeters. Bablu said excitedly. And do you know, since we can also write a tenth using decimal, we can say that the measurement of my foot is 15.4 centimeters. Raju told Bablu. Now Bablu measured his foot. Bablu's foot's measurement is 7 tenths longer than 13 centimeters. Children, can you tell how we can write Bablu's foot's measurement using millimeters and decimal? If you wish to, you may stop the video and find the answer. Bablu's foot's measure is 7 tenths longer than 13 centimeter. This means Bablu's foot's measurement is 13 centimeters and 7 millimeters or 13.7 centimeters. Raju and Bablu bought their new slippers and happily went for a walk on the beach. Children, in this video we learned more about 10th through some interesting examples. In the next video, we will look at some of the misconceptions related to this.